and we have a quite large eastern brown snake. You'll notice I'm not going to get anywhere near as close to this bloke as what I did to those two black snakes before. Now well, eastern browns is a little bit more deadly. I got myself into some hot water on uh, social media recently because I told people that the eastern brown snakes are Australia's deadliest snake. Well, sad thing is, I wasn't lying, they actually are. The mistake I made was that I probably could have said that like most snakes they will try and get out of your way where possible. I didn't mean to put the fear of God into everybody, I certainly wasn't fear mongering which is what I was accused of because they are Australia's number one killer. They're not the most venomous. They're either number two or number three. I'm not quite sure. The inland Taipan is the most venomous. But they are Australia's number one killer with regards to snakes. They've killed approximately 60, they're responsible for approximately 60% of, of snake fatalities. Now, this snake isn't trying to chase us. Although, my wife, is right there photographing and it's moving towards her it could arc up but that's our fault but we photograph these a lot we've got a bit of an idea what we're doing at the moment the snake's reasonably calm now it's going to go under the car which is something I don't want to happen and now I've got to be a bit careful it's going to be quicker now so it's getting a bit agitated and there it's It's just arced up. So now's the time not to get too close and to leave it alone. But look, even though the snake is a bit agitated now, it's still not chasing us, contrary to what people believe. It's getting out of the way. In a sense, we're chasing it. So to correct the error of my ways with my last video, um. yes, the brown snake is Australia's number one killing snake. But, as you saw just then, they are quick to get out of your way. They, damn, they don't chase people. That one didn't chase us. Snakes are cool.